Sam, Sully, you there? God damn it, kid, where the hell have you been? I made it. Had a few close calls, but... Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power, now would be a good time. Well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. Wait, what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here, and as of right now, he has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. With what? I don't have that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing, remember? What if he calls my bluff? <sighs> he won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once, going twice. Oh, screw it. Then we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. For a penny and for a pound. That bid brings Don't us worry. to 120. You'll be out of there in no time. I better be. Okay. Just gotta smash the lock. Now the bit has reached nope. 130,000. We are now at 140. Nothing. Damn it. Your bid, Signore, takes us all the way to 150,000. Gotta be something. Come on. Hey, man, uh, starting to sweat bullets here. Yeah, Bidding give me a second. 160,000 euros in the room. Signore's bid makes 170,000. Yes. Boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's bid, 200,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to bid again? <laughs> Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> okay, let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice. Then I shall sell it for 500,000. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The backup power will come on shortly. It's gone. <laughs> Move it! Get out of the way! Stop him! Hey, stop that guy! Fermo. What are you doing? You're letting him get away! You speak Spanish. What? Sam, tell me you got the cross. I got St. Dismas right here. You want to say hi? Yeah, we really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security's scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around.
maybe we should have brought guns. and get a good vantage point. Merda, se riescono a svegliarsela, non ce la faranno. Li troveremo e li riempiremo di buchi. Ma sappiamo cosa fare. Resta concentrato. D'accordo. Ok. How we doing, Nathan? I'm on my way. Head into higher ground to get my bearings. See you soon. Yeah. Everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. Just gonna play cool. Stroll right on out of here. Oh, scusi. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what, I won't tell anyone if you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? I'm flattered, but uh, I'm afraid I'm spoken for. No, if you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I weren't, I would... You'd what? <coughs> All right, fine. <clears throat> Just remember... I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. <clears throat> Don't telegraph so much. I'm just trying to make it fair. <clears throat> nice try. I gave you that one. Freebie. Oh. <clears throat> That's not nice. <clears throat> Come here. Now hand me the artifact. Do you know how many artifacts I've collected over the years? You're gonna need to be more specific. Let me see if I can clarify. Alright, look. I'm still a little jet lagged. How about we just call it even? Oh, son of a... Have you had enough? Or do you want to keep being a smart ass? Well, you know, being a smart ass has gotten me this far in life. Why quit now? Alright, wait, wait! It's in my back pocket. Where is it? Right there! Alright, I'm at the car. Where the hell are you guys? Uh, I just met your friend, Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, there's total chaos out here. Trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. Queen! 
Vetri rossi! Ho trovato dei vetri rossi! Sono passati a piano! Da questa parte! in there <laughs> I can't get to you from here you got a way down yeah yeah I think so okay I'll meet you at the driveway just head towards the ballroom all right see you there Almost to the ballroom. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. I can use a hand. On my way, Sam. Oh, good. Hey, how's it going? I think I'm 
done with this auction, huh? Oh yeah, me too. I hope I don't go to hell for this. Oh, shit. What? It's empty. What? Oh, you're such an <laughs> asshole. He's your brother. All right. Skull and crossbones. Very good sign. Xavier's insignia. What is this? Uh, Odie mecum eris. In paradise. Today you will join me in paradise. paradise. It's what Jesus said to Saint Dismas on the cross, right? But what about these numbers here? What do, what do you make of this? It's some kind of code or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. 
Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but that means we have date of birth, date of death, and paradise, which means we're looking for Avery's grave. It's St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh -huh. Here's the cathedral, but the graveyard is way over here. <sighs> Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming. Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and her whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. Well, come on, it's both, right? We need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. But with all that you two have been through together... She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. I can't take that chance. <clears throat> Nathan, he's right. But things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and... I can, I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey. Hey, it's me. Yeah. Now the reception's lousy. Yeah. Something on your mind, dear? Look, I, um... Uh, I realize it couldn't have been easy. All those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you. <laughs> but it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. You know, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah. I will. Okay. I love you, too. Just told her that the job was going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth, right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. <laughs> 